Good evening, everybody. Welcome back to Mr. Parker's Share Grow Backyard Gardening. Right now, we're looking at the beefsteak tomatoes. They're about five feet tall right now, but they are all flowering. Really, really nice. Nice to see. Also, these are awesome. Actually, look at that. It's going to be my first fruit from the beefsteak tomatoes. Right on. And this one is up to the pole, which I believe is about seven feet high. Now, I did come down here yesterday evening, check it out. I was going to try and do a video. It was a little too late, so I think I'm right on time now. So let's just go ahead and take a look. I need to step down for a second and get down here. One second. Okay, here we go. Okay, so now these first two sites, I actually have two uh, plants in it. There's two plants there. There's actually two plants there as well. So they're already starting to get the leaf hopper action, if you can see that right there. So I am going to have to definitely get this sprayed tomorrow. Yep, look at that. I got to get on it, man. Especially with these young ones. They'll eat them up alive. Oh, we got some of this action going on there. That's got to come off. Got to come off. The rest of them look okay. Alright, they're looking okay. Zucchini, oh, I got to pull. I only got two. I got a few cucumbers I can pull. And that right there is the Wyatt's Wonder, and that one looks like it's going south on me. And the other Wyatt's Wonder, I think, went down on me as well. So we just have to see what happens because there's more popping up as we go through the season, but I'm not too sure how big they're going to get. But yeah, that's the update on the uh, transplanted tomatoes, and they'll be getting inoculated tomorrow because of this situation right here leaf hopper and also some caterpillars so I will be taking care of that tomorrow so this got a little dug up today took out all the roots from the corn and this one here is ready to harvest this one here yep this one's ready to harvest already. let me get the pruners on that I think I'll have that for dinner tonight I'm going to have some pizza, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to get this and chop it up and put it with my pizza. Yeah, that's some good look aromas. Oh, first aromas of the season. Very good. Oh, and this will be uh, one for the salsa. No, now I'm going to make salsa a little later on, but I got much more clusters of this Roma coming up seems like about every foot away these clusters are coming up so I don't mind at all more clusters here and then another set of clusters here so yeah very nice these two here are not romas at all these just regen from last year and they're starting to flower so pretty happy about that <coughs> So my plans over here, I do have some seeds for here. I got some bell pepper. I have four different types of beans. I have a squash. And uh, it's a different squash too. It's more on the dark side. It's like a black squash. But yeah, this will get ready. And tomorrow I think I'll post a vid on the preparation of the soil and what I'm using. So you guys have a nice evening. Mr. Paco signing off. Peace. See ya.